Hi guys, welcome to LSBD9. So uh, um, tomorrow I'm gonna say an important news, and tomorrow will be the last day I'm gonna show my face. That's the important news. And tomorrow I'll say more details about that. Why, why, uh, from when, okay? And check the description box also, okay? I mean for tomorrow. <laughs> okay. First, the Holy Bible. Should I go to the Holy Bible, right? We, uh, you must have asked verses. Why did, did we didn't we say the verses? Okay, actually, I'm gonna say the verses because I don't remember. I'm gonna Proverbs. Okay. Ah, day one, Proverbs chapter one, verse one to nineteen. Day two, Proverbs chapter two, the Proverbs chapter one, verse nineteen to twenty thirty three. Day three, Proverbs chapter two, verse one to twenty seven. Uh, twenty two, I guess. Okay, let me check. Twenty three or twenty two? Twenty two. Yeah, I'm right. Okay. Proverbs uh, day four, Proverbs chapter. Three Proverbs chapter three, day four right yeah Proverbs chapter three verse one two ah uh -huh, thirty no I don't remember if any one of you remember write it in the comments below okay uh let's skip this this one and that one and now let's go to Proverbs chapter four I don't remember anything now I fully forgot please write in the comments below okay okay okay. I'm going to the next. So, what about today? What will we read today? There. Oh my god. I forgot that itself. Hmm. I have any idea, guys? Nope. Oh my god. I guess it's Proverbs 6. See. I don't remember. Okay, let's check. Okay, let's check. I'm sorry guys, I had a little bit problem, so uh, I guess you cannot see my face, uh, I have took it off, so let's go from uh, Proverbs chapter 7. So have we read this already or not? No, right? Okay. My son, keep my words, lay up my commandments within you. Keep my commandments and life. Guard my teacher teaching as the apple of your eyes. Bind them on your fingers, write them on your tablet of your heart. Tell wisdom, you are my sister. Call understanding, you your relative, that they may keep you from a stranger, the stranger woman, from the foreigner who flatters with her words. For the window sorry, of my house, I looked out through my lattice. I saw among the simple ones. I discerned among... Okay, if anyone knows the meaning of that, then you write in the comments. Among the youth of young man. Void of understanding, passing through the street near her corner, he went. He went. One. I'm really sorry, guys. He went the day to her house in the twilight, in the twilight, in the evening of the day. In the mid middle of the night and the darkness, in the darkness, behold, there a woman met him with a, the attire of a postural rebel without the uh, uh, with crafty intent. She is loud and defiant. Her feet don't see her in her house now. Oh, sorry. Okay.
I spread my couch with carpets of tapestry, with striped clothes of yarn of Egypt. I have perfumed my bed with a mirror, aloes and cinnamon. Come, let's take our fill of loving unit. The morning. Come, let's take our fill of loving unit. Sorry, until the morning. Let's solace ourselves with loving. Well, my husband isn't at home. He has gone on a long journey. He has taken a bag of money with him. He will come. Sorry. He will come home at the full moon with persuasive words. He led the him astray with the flattering of her lips. She seduced him. He followed her immediately. And as an ox goes to the slatter, as a fool stepping into the noose, until a arrow strikes through his liver, as a bird hurries to the snare, and doesn't know that it will cost his life. Okay, so that's it for today. Um, don't forget to comment all the things I have said you. Bye.